I freaking knew it! I knew there was going to be a Five Nights at Freddy's 4! Kiss my ass! As you know it guys, Five Nights at Freddy's 4 is confirmed! Look at this! This looks like it's from the pits of hell! It looks like Freddy fucking Fazbear! Fucked up with three heads! This is scary guys, and it's coming out October the 31st this year! Halloween! And obviously with the Scream Fortress event as well, so that makes it extra lovely. Now seeing as this is coming out on Halloween, we have six months to wait. Oh boy, we're going to get a lot of photos Scott's going to upload, lots of theories. First off, like I said, this is from the pits of hell. Now, I found out that if you bright up the image, you should see the word nightmare, which should be uh, coming up soon. But guys, this is just freaking mind blowing. Get hyped for it. For the people who thought it was the end, it isn't. There's a fourth one. Now it does say the final chapter, but does it? Is it really the end? Just to me, that doesn't even look like. Fred Bear. It doesn't even look like Freddy. I think we're gonna get another, I repeat, another sequel to Five Nights at Freddy's. This doesn't look like a prequel, it looks like a sequel. If it was a prequel, maybe Scott would have made a bit more sense. But this looks more horrifying, more for nightmares. This thing looks like it's gonna kill you in your sleep. Now the possible theories I have for this character, as it's obviously the model of Freddy Fazbear or Fredbear, or it's Golden Freddy. Now possibility it could have the same things with the Springboks, but first off it has three fingers and a thumb, so it's not one of the early suits for a person to go in, so we can rule that out. Secondly, there's an exoskeleton inside it. But what's with the extra Freddy heads? And usually you think this is one of the fake images that usually goes around. Well, it isn't. If you go to Scott Games website right now, at the moment it's having server problems because thousands of people are going on it. But as my theories assume, this is going to be another sequel and this is going to be a nightmare kind of thing. Because it has the word that nightmare, I think think we're truly going to have a final fight against Springtrap, or there's something dark, something twice as worse as the Purple Man that we never knew. This look, looks way more suspicious, way more sinister than the puppet, Springtrap, Golden Freddy. Hell, this thing looks twice as scary as the Withered Ones. So, maybe some sods bought this animatronic, probably it was a remains. Wait a minute, I'm looking at the rock. Holy crap, I think it's Springtrap. I think it's Purple Guy in that suit. I don't know for certain, but I will have a look at some images and try and put them together. I'm just looking at the eyes, I think they could be spring traps or the purple guys but this is the bright one so it's a bit hard to tell but as we're looking at the it's really hard to tell but I think this could be the purple guy but yet again you go ranger purple guy was in the spring trap suit there's no possible way he could just get take the suit off and put another one on by yes that is true and we can see there's an exoskeleton in there we don't know fully this is something exciting guys I'm very looking forward to this and I hope a lot of you are this is gonna build up a lot of hype a lot of theory videos I will be doing some video theory videos on this character and I will say this guys expect more images fucked up as this and possibility a trailer remember guys with the teaser trailer for the third game was revealing the ending, we need to be very observant now. We don't know if this will be the, truly the end for Five Nights at Freddy's, 
or we're gonna head in a new dimension and we'll end up getting so high that we're just shitting ourselves with Fred Bear's fancy pizza. With that really said guys, thank you for watching, I'll do more of this. Also check out my One Night at Putis, I'm not far from finishing the game. And with that said, I'm gonna have nightmares after this thing. Thank you Scott Coffin. I'm gonna cry in a corner now. <laughs>